Hey guys, happy Friday afternoon. Uh, getting ready to do meal two here and uh, showing you what I've got here. Um, in here is about uh, three ounces of uh, grilled chicken. It's left over from what I grilled yesterday. It's about two ounces of, uh, of uh, grass-fed beef, about 97% lean. I'm gonna put it in a pan. I'm gonna put these uh, Rotel spicy kind of uh, tomatoes into it. I'm sure you could make your own. Um, using a half a can of black beans. Full can of green beans with the water. I'm gonna make a little, uh, uh, I guess kind of a little soup, if you will, for, uh, for lunch today. And I'll get back to you in just a second, show you what it turned out like and uh, what kind of seasonings I put into it. I'm a spicy guy. I like my food kind of spicy for the most part. Um, kind of a look inside. Um, and here's what I've added. None of this stuff has MSG as far as I know. Minced onions, uh, chili pepper, cayenne pepper, and a little bit of black pepper. Um, very hearty meal. More so for uh, a guy that you know, just want something that's very robust. It's actually a lot of food. Um, um, you know, so I doubt I'm gonna even be able to eat all of it for lunch. I'll probably put some of it away for a, another meal at another time. But you could also increase this recipe, you know, with protein, with whatever else you want, extra beans or whatever, um, and kind of serve a family style for a whole family if your family's into uh, the stew type of, of meals. Again, another healthy, uh, uh, meal that I put in part of my daily diet um, just using leftover food and, and a couple cans of beans that were in the pantry okay here's the final product I actually had half an avocado left in the refrigerator uh, I'm sorry I had a ripe avocado left in the refrigerator and took half of it and uh, put it in my bowl here and basically split split the meal in half so I'll eat that tomorrow or Sunday or Monday or whatever, but it's gonna hold over just fine. Or somebody else in the family can have it. Um, but that's for lunch. And not that not that you're gonna be counting calories on this Arbonne uh, path, but it's under 500 calories. About 460 calories is what that comes out to be. And again, very hearty meal, very healthy, very delicious. Um, and easy to prepare. It took me 10 minutes, maybe, at tops 10 minutes, and that was because the meat and that chicken was already cooked. I just put it in a pot and boiled it with the rest of the ingredients. All right, that's meal two. Uh, take care. Uh, excuse me if my eyes are a little wet, red, and watery. That was a little spicy, <laughs> to be honest, but it was phenomenally good. So I'm done eating, um, and it dawned on me uh, two things that I wanted to point to your attention because I was over here drinking water Arbonne has these nice uh, bottles here of, uh, you know, that, that measure out 32 ounces of water. And uh, I had that, uh, about half of what was left of it for lunch. It's an important uh, thing to stay hydrated during this 30 day. Well, it's important to stay hydrated period in your health journey, no matter what it may be. Um, and then I'm uh, also taking this uh, fizzy stick back to work with me. This one is the uh, Blackberry. Um, so I'll have this, I'll throw this in a bottle of water later this afternoon. I don't plan to go to the gym today, so I don't need it necessarily for that sense. Um, they just taste good. So that's the reason why I'm taking it back with me to work today. And I uh, hope you enjoyed uh, meal number two for Friday. And uh, we'll get back to you for dinner. In fact, uh, we're eating out tonight. So I'm going to show you how I eat out, um, how Kim eats out. And my kids are going to be with me as well and see if they want to join this video to show you what they're eating.